Hello, it is the start of another weekly vlog. I am wearing no makeup today and that is because I am, wait, let me go sit down. Oh, oh no, I've accidentally got into bed. <laughs> oh dear. Um, I am going to uh, a spa um, to have my eyelashes and my brows did. I'm having eyelash extensions by Nuvo Lashes and I'm having HD brows done as well. I'm so excited. I'm gonna feel like a new woman after this. I would definitely show you kind of what my lashes and brows look like before and after so you can kind of see um, how incredible they will be. But I'm really looking forward to it. I'm also getting my hair done again next week. I'm going all blonde, very excited. So I'm just getting ready to go now. I've had two cups of tea this morning, which is which I think is pretty good going. It's a lot cooler today, which is great. Oh no wait, I shouldn't talk about the weather. I shouldn't be one of those British people that do that. So yeah, I'm off now. Um, Maybe I'll do a before and after now. God, this is a bad angle. These are my eyelashes and my eyebrows terrible angle <laughs> let's go i've just had my lashes done and i'm about to have my brows done i'm going to show you my brows before quickly and then i'll show you my lashes after so this is what they look like so i've had both my brows and my lashes done now brows are still a bit red really pretty i've just got home from circus and washed my hair i'm actually really hungry i haven't eaten much today i've had a sausage roll so now i'm contemplating it's like 10 o'clock and i don't know if that's too late to have food i'm so happy with my eyelashes i think you can kind of see them better here they're really lovely i'm really happy with them they feel really like light and natural um so i'll leave a link to that company down below as well as my brows how good do my brows look hd right mm-hmm i had a parcel come when i was at the hen party so one of my neighbors was looking after it for me and i've just gone to pick it up and oh my goodness it's amazing i didn't know what it was like i just had a letter through my door saying um there's like a parcel next door and then i picked this up it's not a parcel it's a bloody basket it's from Home Edict and it's like, I think it's a little thank you for taking part in their recent campaign, which um, was incredible. It was a great job to do. So they sent me this, lots of pamper stuff. I might like put together a little care package for the neighbor that kept this in her living room for like four days for me as a little thank you. So good, let me open it. I am super excited about this. Um, perfect package for everything you need for a great summer. This is so cute. So wait, what is this? A Chant Mini. Oh my God, it's speakers. I need some speakers. That's absolutely brilliant. We have a Home Edics compact nail polisher. That looks great. I really need to do my nails at the moment. They're not very nice. Um, oh my God, these look amazing. <gasps> Wireless headphones. Home Edics uh, Dulux facial cleansing brush. That looks great. It's got loads of different like head attachments to cleanse your face and we have a soft as silk instant peddy machine this looks great i've never used one of these i'm too scared it would tickle but i'm definitely going to give it a go thank you so much home edicts i also got a little goodie bag today at the um event where i got my lashes done so i'll show you that tomorrow because i'm exhausted now and i definitely want to see if i've got any food in the house is it too late for noodles i'm thinking oh what's happened <laughs> so weird um i am off to gleam today it's friday i've got like an event with it cosmetics at three o'clock in selfridges so i thought that i'd make the most of being in like Lon like central london and go and work from the gleam office because i haven't done this week i like to try and go there to work at least once a week to like get out the house and like knuckle down am i even in focus you can see my eyelashes better today i haven't got any like liquid eyeliner on which i normally wear all the time but um yeah i feel pretty with like minimal makeup which is nice although i have put some eyeshadow on i'm wearing this dress again that i wore to the date i have washed it in between don't you worry Selfridges for an event with its cosmetics. <laughs> <laughs> interrupted by uh, M. Got Megan here as well. Um, I have to get, like, there's loads of vloggers here that I haven't seen in like years, so it's really nice to catch up. And um, look how beautiful this is. <laughs> 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 that is brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Makeup would look good when you add 
have perfect skin, like anything looks good, but I could not find a foundation or concealer that would cover without either breaking up and the redness would come through, um, or starting to, it would be so thick it would crease and crack and make me look 10 years older, like I was wearing a mask. And um, so I started becoming obsessed with beauty products. Uh, so long story short, um, on my honeymoon flight to South Africa, which is really long, <laughs> um, I wrote the business plan uh, for It Cosmetics along with my husband, who's actually here today. We partnered with plastic surgeons, dermatologists, and tried to understand why is it when I put foundation on, I get uh, contact dermatitis everywhere. Why is it that it won't, it, it'll cover, but then it breaks up? And we started formulating products really differently. First, right, and it's almost like a smoothing on a moisturizer, like skincare, but it covers. And so instantly, it just starts to cover, but you're smoothing on your anti-aging skincare, your SPF 50, um, your full coverage, all in one step. And you guys have our brushes. <laughs> so I love these brushes, cruelty free. Morning, sorry I didn't end the vlog last night. I ended up going out for a couple of drinks with um, some of the girls at Gleam, which was really nice. And I accidentally got quite tipsy and got back quite late. So I was like, I'm not vlogging this. I'm gonna make a fool of myself. It is Saturday morning, 10.30. I've already been up and like done some tidying. Um, but I am gonna do my makeup now whilst I watch Love Island. And I thought I'd show you some of the bits that I got at the It Cosmetics event yesterday because I want to try them out today. I'm really, I'm really, really excited about this. Um, I've already moisturized and washed my face, which is why my face probably looks a little bit oily. But the things I'm looking forward to trying today are, yeah, so these are the things I'm most looking forward to using. Firstly, I've heard so much about this, it's their CC color correcting full coverage cream It's basically a moisturizer really great for your skin SPF 50 anti-aging really hydrating but it's a kind of full coverage foundation at the same time so I haven't tried this yet but I'm really excited to also really looking forward to trying the bye bye under eye concealer basically exactly the same but in like really intense concealer so full coverage that it also covers uh tattoos I've got a couple of brushes which i'm really excited to use they're so soft this one's really cool it's like a buffing brush with like a little concealer brush on the other end and then we have a brow pencil which is uh incredible it's one shade fits all which normally i'd be like uh no my brows are so dark but you literally just it's all about the pressure so for like light blonde hair you just press quite lightly to get light strokes and for dark brows you pr press like heavier uh, this mascara is apparently incredible, Superhero It Mascara and their Bye Bye Pores Pressed Powder as well. I'm looking forward to trying. So I'm basically going to do my makeup using all of these products and I will show you how it goes at the end. This is my makeup. Really happy with it. I haven't put lipstick on again. I'm so bad. My house is an absolute tip at the moment and it's really... um making me anxious it's not good today i am re-celebrating father's day because i was at the hen party last weekend so i didn't get to spend the day with my dad so i'm meeting up with him and my mum and sister today and we're going to celebrate it i don't exactly know what we're doing my mum's planned it all but i'm really looking forward to spending the day with them i feel like i haven't seen my family in a really long time so i'm looking forward to this i'm also going to stay around their house um, tonight and then I think we're, me and my mum and sister are going to go shopping tomorrow. It's my sister's engagement party next weekend, next Saturday. So I popped into Forever 21 yesterday um, before the It Cosmetics event. I had a couple of um, minutes spare so I popped in and I got some dress options. I'll show you them now quickly and then I might try them on for you tomorrow so you can see. The first is this, it's really pretty like silk ribbed um dress we're like off the shoulder we have like an off the shoulder um silk pink dress and another one which is like exactly the same but even more like silky so they are my options as you can see the theme is pink i also i don't know if i mentioned this but i my cousin was selling a car um a couple of weeks ago and i decided to just buy it it was very very cheap so now i have a car at my house which is amazing it's like a proper luxury you have it like being able to go and do the food shop and not have to worry about carrying loads of bags all the way home um so yeah i'm really excited and it means that i can go and visit my parents a lot easier because it's like a 10 minute drive away so i'm gonna drive to their house now in the new car it'll be my second time in the car it's a really nice drive actually it's it's quite old i think it's like 11 years old the car itself i'm not fancy i'm not into like fancy cars just being able to have one here in london is great so yeah i'm gonna drive to their house now and yeah 
I am excited, I'll take you with me. We are, um, oh my god, that scared me. We are near, uh, we're near Tower Hill Bridge, Tower of London, and we're heading down to have some brunch and cocktails. Where's my dad? They're not behind us. <laughs> Got the Tower of London there. Very exciting. Chin -chin. This is a white sangria, peach sangria, I think. <laughs> so, you know I'm collecting fridge magnets now. Well, I haven't got one for London. Shall I? Do I dare? It is quite late now, it is nearly 10 o'clock. Oh, I look like I've got a massive fire pit. Um, we went to a members bar called the King's Head. My dad has membership and I've just purchased it to the year because it's amazing in there. And we just now ended up in our local chicken shop. Mama's chicken and ribs. There's some chicken. It is Sunday morning, which means one thing, food shopping with dad. I'm in charge of the trolley. <laughs> what are we looking for? Um, raffle tickets. Raffle, raffle tickets? Oh, here. Cloakroom tickets. Can I explain a game to you? A game? It's called The Floor is Lava. So when someone says the floor is lava, then you have to, the floor turns into lava and you have to try and find where, somewhere to stand so you don't die. Off the floor? Yeah. Right. So now I'm going to say the floor is lava to you at some point and then you've got, you've got like five seconds to try and find somewhere to stand. Yeah. Got it? Yeah. Okay. Not right now. When you least expect it. Okay. <laughs> and you're not going to be videoing, are you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the floor is lava, daddy. The floor is lava. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, well done. <laughs> that was great. Was that hard? <laughs> Normal chocolate hobnobs, £1.60. Extra chocolate hobnobs, £1.50. Bargain. Oh. All of my stuff is chocolate based. <laughs> Miniature shambord. Feet in the palm of my hand. I bloody love a shambord. This is so cute too. Miniature things. So cute. I've now come to Lakeside with my mum, dad and sister and we've been trying to shop for outfits for um, the party next week. And I bought some stuff, not for the party, but I just wanted to show you quickly because I'm really happy with them all. I got these trousers from New Look. They're so beautiful and actually really flattering yeah. on the leg love these i also bought some shoes from dorothy perkins they were on sale i think they were like 12 pounds and these ones as well i just really want to add some color into my wardrobe and i think shoes are a nice way of doing that at the moment so very happy with my purchases daddy are you happy with your purchases we've just come to luke's house he's my sister's fiance and we're just having a what would you call this we're having a pre-party meeting <laughs> Luke is all the way over there the with the notes. Right, What's our next subject? Um, oh, I've got Moxie down, Tubby down, Daddy has all of her. What other extras if you think you've been invited that we don't know about? Please. Well, Thelma and Kevin are coming. Thelma and Kevin, tell me. I thought Kevin. we sent an invitation. I am home and in bed now. Um, I got back at about 8 o'clock and I've just been doing some housework and work work since then. And now I'm already for bed. I'm going to end this vlog here. I really hope you've enjoyed this one. I feel like I started off at a bit of a weird one and I was just a bit uh, away with the fairies and not entirely concentrating whilst I was vlogging but I feel like towards the end it got a bit better so I hope you enjoyed it. Just checking my nipples on in short. <laughs> yeah, I will, I will see you next week on my next weekly vlog. <laughs>